Go Bizu. Sorry for pronouncing your name great because I don't really know how you say that. But it's simple. If you want to have the flowers say how many flowers you've collected so far, it's literally all you have to do is go to the flower and um, insert short um, text. You have seen collect collected, and all you have to do is backslash or forward slash whatever. Type in V, and then again you would do this, and then put the number five. Actually, you wouldn't put B, but you will put the number. B is basically hold on. Ah, I'm so confused. Put B and. Let me just do something real quick. I forgot to check what variable the flower is, and it is variable one. Okay, so basically, simple. I'm gonna explain it to you. Um, you basically do a short text, um, and then you do a backslash or forward slash. I don't know which slash this is, but you do that, and then you put a V right after it. You put a, I don't know what you call that, and then you put the. What's wrong with me on explaining stuff? You put the number of the variable, the variable ID, which all you have to do is basically go to variables and then click this. And then it says the number that's on here, it says 0001. You just put the one and not all the zero zero. And if it's like 20, put 20. So basically put the um, ID of the variable there. So to see all the other commands, all you have to do is take your cursor and put it over the text. And leave it there, and it will show you all the all the little commands, and then you pick whichever one you want. In this case, you put the V one. You just copy this, and you basically paste it on all the other flowers, and paste in it, paste in, paste in. So basically, what that does is it basically shows you how many variables that you of that variable that you pick that you have. So if you have two, it's gonna say two instead of slash v and everything else. And if you have three, it's gonna say three. And we're gonna go ahead and test this out real quick. We're gonna get that quest again, and let's go out into the field. So basically, you've collected one out of five flowers. And then you go over here, you've collected two out of five flowers, you've collected three out of five flowers, <coughs> excuse me, I am sick right now, um, four out of five flowers, and five out of five flowers, and even, unless you like turn it off or whatever, it's just going to keep on doing this, so six out of five, seven out of five, so it doesn't matter, all you have to do is basically put that command, you don't even have to think about it, um, just... Um, do I want to sleep? Yes, I do want to sleep, but let's go ahead and talk to this guy. Hello. Hello. Why is he saying that? But whatever. That's basically how you would do it. Um. Yeah, well, that's basically for this video. If you have any more questions, go ahead. Oh, yeah, let me explain this real quick again, just in case you didn't get it. Um, again, if you want to see all these commands... All you have to do is take your cursor, put it over the text, and it's going to show you the list of everything that you could do it. So basically, what this does is you put um the you put the forward slash, I think that's what it is, or the backslash, whatever. You put the first slash to show you that it's um that you're that you're about to do something that the text won't pick up. Like if you do this, it's just going to say zero because the game doesn't actually know what. Actually, right now the thing is at zero, but. You basically just do this command to tell it what you want to do, and then you put the brackets or parent no the brackets around it, and then you put the num the number of the ID number of the variable, and then this text after it, it like if you didn't put this text here it's just gonna say zero, but if you wanna uh, make it show you basically just do what you would regularly do, and then you preview and it says zero out of five. And that's basically it for this video. Thanks for watching and thank you for the sub. And I will see you on my next video tutorial. Stay tuned. That's funny. That's, that's always funny to say. But seriously, peace.